what is going on my friends and um, today I'm just going to be doing this live video to show you the best Jeeps of SEMA 2018. We're here at SEMA and on the upper hole, the south hole and the Jeeps here are really crazy guys. I'm just going to be visiting a lot of companies like for example let's let me show you the new best stop half doors and they look really really nice a lot of crazy crazy builds here guys I'm sure you guys are going to love this this video just look at the new half doors from best stop they have really nice quality Dímelo, ¿cómo está la cosa? Guys, just look at this. They look really, really nice. Just look at the running board. Or power steps, however you want to call it. Let's keep walking now, guys. As you can see, SEMA is full. We can even walk in here. <laughs> but I'm going to do my best of showing you the coolest Jeeps around. Look at this massive winch front, super winch. Looks really nice. Here you can find some crazy builds like this. Just look at this. It is crazy. You have to have a company to be able to, to come here. Yep, you have to apply on cima.com and they, then they will accept you and that's how you, you can come to CIMA let's keep walking guys and as you can see there are a lot of people in here it gets crazy a lot of new JL jeeps here another JL and look at this hey what's up Rocky look at this um, pods guys monitor on the hood looks different and a lot of trucks this year here let me show you another cool Jeep. Look at this top. From Rubicon Express. Showing you the latest parts. G2 axles. Look at this JK. looks really nice but now let's keep walking yeah let me show you the police car they were bringing It is a Mustang. Yeah, it looks really nice. Yesterday there was a, a 
a Mustang, like a police car, drifting around. It was really, really nice. And I have seen a lot of trucks this year, even more than last year. And this is the salt hole. And here we have a lot of jeeps and off-road action. All the cool jeeps are here. Another JL. Of course, a lot of products too. They're showing the Rhino racks. How we doing, guys? And walking here, as you can see, it's a little crazy. There are a lot of people here. Now, let me show you a really nice build. Just look at this jeep. It looks re really, really nice. And I like this fender. Looks different. 42 inch tire. Look how massive this jeep looks. Looks like mine. And all of these are light, so... I haven't seen them here because SEMA is huge. I have been looking for a lot of companies that I haven't seen. Guys, to be able to see everything here, you have to come for at least four days to SEMA. Because if not, you're not going to be able to see everything there is to see on SEMA. SEMA is huge. And when I say huge, you, you guys have no idea what that means. There are thousands of thousands of cars here and trucks and jeeps and basically everything. SEMA is a little crazy and I'm glad it's not open to the public because there are a lot of people and a lot of companies here that you can even walk because of how packed this is. Basically, every single company is here. And the dynamics are showing their new lights. They look good. This is the new JL light, so they have modified it to look like this. And now we are at the rock crawler booth. Look at these half doors, guys. They look really nice. The only thing I don't like is that it doesn't have any, any handle to open it from outside. But again, many of you will like it. Rip Supercharger. 
people tires. And here we have Alexo, Lenia. Hey, how are you? And look at this build, guys. It is massive. looks really really nice let me keep showing you around guys there are a lot of things to see on SEMA like for example this Jeep truck and it looks really amazing And a lot of really cute chicks. Just look at there. That's a really nice deal. I really like this truck. Look at this bed, solid wood. No, let's keep walking. And basically everybody's here, guys. Every car related company is here. I have been walking for a while and I haven't shown you basically anything. New Terraflex, Jeep, and Dennis, of course. Many of you know him. Let's look at that deep over there. Massive. And look how cool this thing looks. A ramp made with JK parts or Jetty parts, of course. <laughs> And look at this beauty. Guys, I'm talking about the car. Hey, what's up, French guy? Look at this Comanche. Yeah. I saw the picture yesterday and I love it. Look at this paint job. Looks really, really nice. And these are the new rigid mirrors. I love them. New Alpha radio. This Comanche is basically new. I would like to build something like this. Model build fuel tank. 
power tank, king shocks. Looks freaking amazing. Let me see what kind of axles those deep things have. They look like F250 axles. But I really like the like the color or the graphics on this Comanche. Now oh, let's keep walking. A lot of cars and trucks, a lot of jeeps. That's why sometimes I don't like doing live video because you have to walk and walk and walk. But thank you all for being here and be watching live. Let's keep walking, walking and walking. Yesterday I got here around 1 p.m. and I walked like 12 miles. So today I'm going to be walking even more than 12 miles. See my huge. This thing is full. I'm trying to find more jeeps to show you guys. That's why I'm taking so long. As you can see, a lot of lightings and accessories back here, but not jeeps. So let's keep walking to find the coolest jeep around. And a funny fact, guys, there are no two-door jeeps here. Of course, you can see a TJ, but I'm talking about JKs and JLs. They are not... I haven't seen a single two-door JK or a single two-door JL here. That's crazy because many people have two-door Jeeps. And I haven't seen, well, you, you guys haven't seen on this video a two-door JK or a two-door JL. Basically, every single company is trying to show their latest products on a four-door. And I have no idea why. Just look, another four door. Hey Roberto. Hi, how are you? Just take a look guys. You're not going to see any two door Jeep here. And these are the cars that you can see all over SEMA. This one has two engines with two superchargers and that thing must fly just look at this grill and this hood what do you think about this cliff ride as you can see it is a four door and look at this, this is massive. 
That's a really, really nice overlanding setup. And another four door, of course. Let's keep walking. And you can see a lot of really nice chicks. Look at those fenders. They're way too big. But again, maybe they have a purpose. This Jeep looks really nice. Look at this JL top. With a supercharger. These crazy looking fenders. Maybe they have a purpose. You can let me know in the comments below. Another four door JL. And as you can see, there are not a single two door JL or JK here. Another four door. And another four door. Let's keep walking guys, because there are a lot of more jeeps that I have to show you. And a lot of really good looking models. I have seen a lot of Japanese and Chinese people here. That's really weird to find so many Japanese people in one place because I'm not used to seeing them around. I'm from Miami, as many of you know. There are not so many Japanese people over there. Now let me show you a really nice looking JL. Look, look at those wheel tints. This Jeep looks weird. I have a weird, I guess, wrap. Let me touch it. Yeah, it is a wrap, guys. But it looks really nice on this Jeep. This wrap. I really like this wrap. Just let me know what do you think about it. And now let's keep walking. I think we are half halfway halfway through. Another JL. And we are of course at the Fat Force booth here on SEMA. And I want to show you the new DVA of road tire carrier that they just came out for the for the new JL. Sorry that I took so long. New DVA half doors.
let me show you the other Jeep. And the other Jeep was built by Starwood Motors. And it looks really nice. Look at the color, guys. And this Jeep must be expensive as hell because Starwood Motors built it. But let me show you what I was talking about. The new tire carry. Many of you know that they have like this tubular design instead of instead of this they have the same thing as this and now they upgraded it to this and in my opinion i think it looks better this way but now let's keep walking like i was saying guys every single jeep company is here oh my god a two-door finally i found a two-door jk crazy when jk's came out every single jeep was a two-door uh, nobody was buying a four-door now to find a two-door is weird everybody is buying four doors as you can see all the companies are reflecting that on their bills and we have another two-door that's even more weird. Finding two straight, two doors is weird. Guys, if you are enjoying this video, please give it a big thumbs up because that would really help me a lot. So give it a like if you enjoyed this video. And let's keep walking, guys. This is just one, one big show. I can't even walk anymore. I'm so tired. About. And I see another two door over there. rugged rich I love seeing classic gibs and guys there is a company called Mahindra car company maybe many of you have heard about it they are I think they are from India and they have a lot of cars a lot of their gibs here Look at these guys. This look really, really nice. From Rugged Ridge. Let's keep walking. We had problems with our customer service at the time. There are some upcoming Jeeps. Really nice Jeep that I want to show you. Guys, if you are enjoying the video, please give it a like because that will help me a lot. Look at this wrap. How cool is this? I really like this Jeep. I wouldn't build it this way, but it looks different. Uh, 
and now we are at the Icon suspension booth and I can have some really nice suspension components for our dips coilovers, long arms and all those kind of stuff and like I was telling you guys a lot of really hot checks these are the things that you can find all over SEMA hot chicks, jeeps, trucks and really nice cars and ARB is coming so let's keep walking to the ARB booth ARBs have some really nice off-roading products so let's see what they have to show us this is a Westin Jeep I really like the the wrap. This is the ARB Jeep and of course it is the new Wrangler JL. And they also decided to go with the four door of course. Just look at the new shocks. And this is the new jack. <laughs> Looks really nice. And I think I'm going to need a set of this. That would really help me if I ever get stuck. And of course, if you are going off roading and you are in a muddy situation, you can always get stuck, no matter how big is your Jeep or how big are your tires. There will be always a place where you are going to get stuck. Guys, I'm going to be ending this video soon. So I hope you really like it. And if you are still watching, just hit that like button. Just look at this overlanding setup. And again, another JL, four doors. That tent is really large. Thing like four people or even three people can sleep in there. Looks really nice. So guys, I'm going to end this video now because we have come to the end already. And I have to keep filming videos for all of you. So I hope you really like this video, give it a big thumbs up, a like, and if you haven't subscribed, click that subscribe button because I have to show you a lot of really nice Jeep. Not only the ones I show you already, but there are a lot of Jeeps all over SEMA that I want to show you. So see you guys later, bye!